I'm here to submit a petition against the Commissioner of Police in, in Benin because uh, before the election, uh, we were adopted by Philip Shaibu and his uh, uh, police orderlies to Benin where they tried to forcefully uh, uh, put a gun in our hands. And at the end of the day, we resisted and refused the gun. In, during this call in Benin, before they took us to state CID, they took my Daytona wristwatch uh, with diamond, uh, uh, with diamond, uh, a golden Daytona wristwatch studded uh, with diamond, my name on it, Jared, on it. And they took it from me. I'm um, one of my diamond rings. And when I got, when I, I wrote my statement that period, and I told them that uh, that uh, Daytona gold wristwatch was taken from me by Philip Shaibu, uh, by Philip Shaibu Audley. And I did my petition, and in that petition, it was very clear, and it took our uh, 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 fingerprint to ascertain whether the, the pistol they, they were trying to force on us was, was from us, and I think they discovered it wasn't from us. Since then, that issue has been there. They've not investigated it, they've not returned my Daytona watch to me, which I asked them. And when they now released us, and as I was going, uh, when I got to Jetu, Philip Shebo also supervised, and they shot at me, and I identified three people, Abbas Yakubu, Oliman, and Sanu Imo Edume. They were the ones that shot me, and the matter was reported at the state CID, uh, at uh, area command in, in Auchi, and the matter was taken to uh, uh, Benin. And till now, they have not invited any of them. But to my dismay, and to my surprise, this year, about some few weeks ago, I went to America. I was in New York. And in New York, I got to hear that there was uh, this FMI Congress that was going on in, in New Jersey. And I attended. To my surprise, I saw Philip Shebo with my Daytona wristwatch, with my name, Diamond on it. So I wanted to embarrass him, but I was asked to slow down. And I should take the matter because it was outside the country and it will not be good for such a thing to happen. So I kept quiet, I kept mute, I came back to Nigeria to report to them how, they, how I saw the work in Philip Shebu's hand. To date, they have not said anything, so I had to come here to do a petition to compare the Commissioner of Police to take, collect my watch from Philip Shebu and return it back to me. That's all I'm asking for. I need the Inspector General of Police to compare the Commissioner of Police in Benin to tell Philip Shaibu to return my watch to me. Because if that watch is not returned, since it, is, it has turned to a matter of theft, I am ready to confront Philip anywhere I see him. I don't care whether he's deputy governor. I'm ready to confront him. If I see him with any watch, I will take it from him. I don't know whether he's going to sell it because that wristwatch is gold Daytona watch with my name inscribed on it with diamond. And that watch is about two hundred and fifty thousand dollars. It was custom. It's custom made, specially made for me, and I need that watch back. That's the reason why I'm here to submit that petition to the IG today.